Okay. Now we can start doing some lackey shenanigans here. See what kind of six cost we get. Hey guys, I hope you're hungry because we're going to be making some scrambled eggs with this new egg lackey Zulok. So I was inspired by one of my more previous decks that I made, the Gandling Zulok. And that deck is performing really well. There's actually a lot of games played and some statistics on HS Replay for that. So if you haven't already checked that out, I'll leave a link somewhere on the screen for you to go ahead and click on. But I was inspired by the Gandling and the egg synergy, being able to automatically pop those eggs. So I figured what if we take that a step further and we run like Evil Genius to go ahead and eat those eggs and create lackeys and create a lackey package around it. So there's so many cool combos that you can do with this deck. To throw down a couple of your eggs with the Gandling to automatically pop them, to buffing up your lackeys with the Takan, to go ahead and buffing everything up with the new Wicked Whispers card. We also do run the Lorekeeper Polkelt, so that way it automatically draws us the Hand of Gul'dan's, which then further draw into a really big powerful stuff, like the Takan, the Gandling, the Matrons, and our eggs and all that cool stuff. Yeah, I had a lot of fun making this deck. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, let me know by leaving a like down below it takes literally two seconds but it helps me out a ton and this deck like most decks on this channel are handcrafted tested and refined by me for you so if you like off meta decks then click that subscribe button and hit that bell notification to make sure that you never miss out on another cool off meta deck again i do also stream all of these decks in the deck building process live monday through friday on twitch and the link for that is going to be down below in the description but for now let's hop into the gameplay stay funky if you don't mind this um, this is actually a pretty good hand if it's like an aggro demon hunter. I kind of like a Sinister Deal because like depending on what they are, we can get something. Like if they play a mini on turn one, it means that they're aggro, we can get like a shoot lackey. Whirl kick rogue, yep, yep. You know, it's crazy. Like the only way, the only consistent way to beat a shaman is to scam them harder with a 2020 Edwin. Right, yeah. I mean, that's how you know that it's a problematic thing. Where it's like the only way to scam a scammer is to scam them even harder, you know? Okay, let's go Faceless Lackey, because they didn't develop anything here, so. Yeah, thanks for the thanks for the 10 bits, by the way, Daz. I appreciate that. You have the 4-mana Legendary that makes a Lackey when you play a Lackey. Yes, I do. Yep. Um, but I figure we don't really need that in this meta. Ooh, the Takan! Ooh! The Takan? I kind of hope he doesn't kill this. Probably will though, right? Okay, so it's OTK Demon Hunter. Yeah, okay. So we have to kill them before they kill us. Oh, dude, this is actually perfect. Um, The Death Scamp, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to save the Evolve Lackey because I want to evolve the Takan if that sticks. Oh, nice. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. All right, yeah. So next turn, I'm going to coin out this uh, Takan. Turn after that, just play uh, every single Lackey that we have. Be pretty cool. Oh, nice. They're going to kill it. Are they stream sniping? Do they know that we're playing Takan? Oh, man. This is actually so good, too, though. Nah, I think, I think this is better. Because this way kind of spreads out the damage a little bit. Oh, whoa. Man, the Ladari. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this guy... Is this guy a token demon hunter? And not OTK? That's interesting. Okay. Now we can start doing some lackey shenanigans here. See what kind of six cost we get. <laughs> what have I done to the Hearthstone gods? Why me? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> What have I done? 
We traded these off, but um, so turn seven, I guess I could do 14 damage split up with expendable for expendable performers, right? So we have what six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eighteen. So I guess they do get close to a full clear i might even dude whoa 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 okay okay i i see you i see you let's see here so we got eight damage but we're kind of on a timer now because they did that they kind of want to do something like this here this is what 18 damage. Oh, dude, is this lethal? Ah, <laughs> nice. Nice. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Woo. Hey, all right. So we got rewarded at least. Thank you. Thank you. See, the Hearthstone gods heard me. Warrior. We can actually do really well against Warrior. We can definitely do well. Yeah, you always keep the hand. I don't really want to keep the eggs. Uh, I guess Cable Rod is not bad. That's not bad. They're tr probably trying to prep for some updates and whatnot across all games. So hopefully we get some nerfs soon. Is this guy really roping us? Or is he just AFK? I mean, I don't mean to brag or anything, guys, but uh, currently standing, we have a 100% win rate against AFK opponents. <laughs> oh, crap. This guy's not AFK. All right. Guess we lose. <laughs> Shoot. It's really hoping to maintain our 100% win rate against AFK opponents. I faced six shamans in a row. Oh, that's gross, Addy. That's disgusting. Um, discover a spell. I don't want a dragon because it might be more expensive than the hands. So if we draw like a nightshade matron or a merchant, that won't work. Um, maybe we just go for more damage here on the lackey. Yeah see that working soul fire perfect we could maybe finagle our hand uh use a soul fire and uh discard the hand nice nice yeah next turn we can like serpent egg play whatever we top deck coin and then soul fire guarantees a hand uh discard Music is great? Yeah, thanks. Glad you like it. Glad you like it. Yeah, we're, uh, we like to switch it up a little bit. Today we're playing some 80s. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Let's go. Do I ever play out this wisp? Hmm. I don't think so. It might die to like some risky skipper shenanigans. Maybe I save this for like a gandling then. 100% win rate versus rope bots. Yeah, exactly. Too bad this guy isn't a rope bot. <sighs> uh, I'm probably going to tap here. My hand's kind of disgusting. Hoggers? Uh, Poggers? So next turn I go Gandling, plus Egg, plus Wisp. 
four. So now I can go lackey or faceless lackey plus like Voidwalker. Uh, play it on this side and kiss his dire wolf. All right, so if they clear the board, I have some insane refill here. I mean, even if they do clear the board, though, like, I still actually have insane refill just from the eggs I currently have. My board is almost too full. <laughs> nice, the brawl! Yes, let's go, let's go. Yeah, clear my board. Do it, do it. Dare ya. I dare you to. Just don't... Really? Dude, screw you. <laughs> screw you, dude. <laughs> Alright, so we already saw one brawl at least, though. Um, this makes three dudes, four dudes. So we have to make some board space, so this works. That's right. That's what you get for letting your dude win the brawl. Get wrecked. <laughs> What's your favorite band? Um, probably Shinedown or Breaking Benjamin, I have to say. I'm a rocker. A rocker at heart. Kind of crazy that we've had three weeks of Shaman Stun already. I know, right? And it could have been completely prevented. All right. Well, we can go um, Pole Kelt here at least. This will for sure draw us Dark Pharaoh Takan into a Matron. Yeah. Um, I think actually trade. Why? I mean, we don't actually have to, right? Because they already played both the Risky Skippers. They're gonna probably gonna trade for us. We don't need to tap into it because I won't be able to play it anyways. Go face. How about Muse? Yeah, Muse is a good band. Um, probably not my favorite, but it, it's definitely a good band. I do like Muse. Radiohead? Yeah, that's a good one. That's also very solid. All right, this would be a good evolved target. Assuming they don't like shield slam it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this guarantees our matron. Now, do we play out the matron right now? Mm hmm. And then we're, we're guaranteed some two cost stuff. Okay. Okay, this is gonna be getting out of hand, so we probably wanna kill that. Dude, it's, um. I think this is okay. Okay. And because, yeah, if the Witchy Lackey does live, then we do get to transform that into a 4 4. So I think that's fine. That's fine. Can we play Rafam in this deck? Probably not, just because it gets in the way of like Nightshade and Matron and the Expired Merchant. Radiohead? Yeah, Radiohead's, Radiohead's good. All right, something like that. Something like that. Something like that. They already burned two Risky Skippers here, so I'm not really too afraid of like Risky Skipper shenanigans. We win? Brawl? Yeah. Well, you do get a taunt back from the safeguard. Nice. <laughs> okay, or that, or that happens. All right. <laughs> They're still gonna attack into it. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> I probably would have like matron to discard the merchant and then play a couple lackeys, uh, four fours. Nice. Nice. Thanks for watching. If you made it this far, make sure to leave a like down below and also subscribe if you want to see more original off meta decks just like this.
and check out this sweet video. You're gonna love it, I promise. See you there.